Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading recap for Tuesday, August 3rd. Another green day today, plus $442. So, uh, no mighty 90s today. Did a pairs trade in NASDAQ versus Dow, book 295 on that. And then on the runners, slightly green, uh, S&P uh, futures minus 45. NVIDIA was an exact scratch. Uh, DKNG plus 39, Roku plus 161, Zoom minus 235, Roblox plus 242, and Piton, uh, basically a scratch, minus 15. So let's go through these. I'll show you what we did. Uh, let's start with the S&P futures. So uh, what we did here is uh, Marcus was just really weak to start out of the gate. And so when the S&P bounced, got short right here, got out of half down here near the lows of day, and then this thing just ripped higher. So I ended up closing out of my last piece here. So net it, netted a uh, uh, winner on the first piece, loser on the second piece. So net minus 45 on that one. Uh, NVIDIA had a nice profit, and then this thing really started flushing. Um, had this, so even with the market being weak out of the gate, NVIDIA was pushing. So when it pulled back to this uh, key level here, got long, pushed up, got out of, um, I think I did three contracts. So got out of two thirds of it up here, and then this thing just really flushed down. Uh, by the time I got out down here, it was basically a scratch overall on the trade. DKNG, small winner, basically a scratch here. Uh, had this big volume bar, so on this little bounce, got short, got out of uh, some of it here, and then it just kind of bounced. And when it got up here, I just I, it was just kind of grinding, not showing a lot of not showing a lot of emotion. So I just uh, got out of it there. Uh, booked thirty nine on that one. Uh, Roku, small winner, one sixty one. Uh, so in Roku. Um, had this uh, initial push up. I didn't, I was trying to get filled on this push higher, didn't get filled, it, it happened too quick. And then uh, started flushing. And so when it bounced up to unchanged, got short and got out of one piece here and then it just started chopping around. So I got out of my other piece for small winner, plus 161. And then zoom, uh, zoom, I was looking for an upside run, had some big volume here. So when it pulled back to Yesterday's high, I was looking for a bounce and the rest of the market, I mean, it just pulled everything down. Uh, so as it kind of continued to push down, just cut out a uh, small position, minus 235. Roblox, uh, Roblox is a downside runner. So on this uh, big volume spike here, when it bounced, got short, got out of some here, sat through a little bounce, came back down, just started chopping around. So I got out of the rest there, plus 242. And then Piton was kind of similar to, um, NVIDIA had a nice profit here, uh, caught this little upswing here, got out of most of it. And then when it rolled over, cut out of the, uh, cut out of the rest, but it flushed so quick, ended up taking a minus $15 on that one. Uh, and that's it. And then the pairs trade, uh, I'll, I'll show you the pairs trade here. So entered this, uh, pre-market, uh, that the, uh, the Dow had a nice flush, S and P flushed, Russell flushed, but the NASDAQ did not looking at pre-market here. And so I ended up getting long NASDAQ and short the Dow. Uh, actually, this is the flush I was talking about. And uh, Dow stayed weak. NASDAQ stayed a little bit stronger. So booked, uh, booked a nice profit there. So plus 442 on the day. I'll take it. It's kind of a choppy, weird price action day. So uh, I'm, I'm okay coming out with a, with a decent little profit. So we'll be live streaming tomorrow. Look forward to seeing you all then. Take care.